While it offers a secure login experience for both Microsoft and third-party accounts, Microsoft Authenticator may act up on your phone. If Microsoft Authenticator is not working properly on your phone as well, then this video is for you. The first fix is to completely kill the app and then restart it. To force stop Microsoft Authenticator on Android, long press on its app icon and tap the I icon. Finally, tap on the force stop option. Now, if you have an iPhone, swipe up from the bottom of the screen to access the app switcher. Locate the Microsoft Authenticator card and swipe upwards to close the app. Like any other app, the Microsoft Authenticator app requires permission to display notifications on your Android or iPhone. If you have previously declined this permission, Microsoft Authenticator won't show any login approval requests on your phone. To enable the same on Android devices, long press on the Microsoft Authenticator app icon and tap the iInfo icon, tap on notifications. Finally, enable the toggle next to Authenticator Notifications. To enable the notifications on iPhone, open the Settings app, scroll down, and tap on Authenticator. Tap on Notifications, and enable the toggle next to Allow Notifications. If your phone's clock is not in sync, Microsoft Authenticator won't work. To fix this, you can enable your phone's automatic date and time feature. To do that on Android devices, open Settings and scroll down till you find System. Now tap on Date and Time. Finally, enable the toggle next to Set Time Automatically. For iPhone users, launch the Settings app on your iPhone and navigate to General. Tap on Date and Time. And finally, toggle on the switch next to Set Automatically. Another important fix is to turn off battery optimization for the Microsoft Authenticator app. Please note that this is an Android-only fix. Such fixes are not available for iPhone users. So, to turn off battery optimization, tap the three-dot icon in the top right corner. From the menu, tap on Turn Off Battery Optimization and select Allow to confirm. The next fix is also an Android-only fix, as it requires clearing app cache of Microsoft Authenticator. Do note that clearing the Microsoft Authenticator cache does not remove any of your accounts. To do that, long press on the Microsoft Authenticator app icon and tap on the I Info icon. Tap on Storage and Cache. Now, finally tap on the Clear Cache option. It might be possible that the Authenticator app is not showing codes for a specific account. In that case, you need to re-authenticate your account to start receiving codes again. To do that, open the Microsoft Authenticator app on your phone. Select the account of your choice. Now tap the gear icon in the top right corner and select Remove Account. Select Remove Account to confirm. Now tap the plus icon at the top and follow the on-screen prompts to add your account again. Lastly, if none of the solutions work, then it might be possible that the Microsoft Authenticator app is outdated. If this is the case, then head over to the Play Store on Android or App Store on iPhone to check if a newer version is available. Hopefully, you are now able to fix the issue of Microsoft Authenticator on your Android and iPhone. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials related to your everyday technology. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.